Nick Cannon mornings on Power 106. It's going down. It's time for a very special up close and personal conversation. Close conversations with people that I really admire, that I feel like are doing their thing in the game. And this young man is definitely doing it. Multifaceted, multi-talented. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, like he's he's a, he's a new talent on the block, but he's already opening the box office with 185 million easy. Uh, <laughs> the star of the Lion King. And many other things as well. Artist extraordinaire, J.D. McCrary. How you doing, brother? I'm good. How are you? Man, I'm good, man. I, I, you come in the room and light up the room with all this personality, man. Where does that come from? Oh, well, I guess it comes home. It comes from home. <laughs> that's, that's just me. Now, I'm going to tell you the first time I uh, uh, came uh, across your talents and your gifts, um, I feel like it was the... A video someone shared of you know kind of doing your thing at a at an NBA game, right? Like, yeah. and you were, you you I I I saw the production in it, but I appreciated the fact that soon as it was one of those things where it's the finish the lyric, but magically you knew the whole lyric, the whole song, and blew everybody away <laughs> <laughs> with the rendition of "Who's Loving You." Yes. Uh, man, your vocal ability, especially, you know, tackling a, a Michael Jackson classic. Uh, I knew I was like, yo, this kid's destined for stardom. And it was Thank like, you, it, man. it came across um, my desk when, uh, at my label at, at Universal. And I was like, yo, this dude, is he's going to do his thing. And then here you are starring in The Lion King, man. So congratulations. Yes, Thank you. Uh, being Simba, how did that come about? Well, I was in Atlanta at the time. I was shooting a show that I'm on, uh, Tyler Perry's The Pains. Yeah. Yeah, I was shooting that. And my mom said that I have an audition for The Lion King. Yeah. Did the audition. Got a call back. Cool. <laughs> got the call back. Did another call back. Cool. Did it. Then I went home to L.A. Yeah. And I met with the executive producers and all the people that, you know, run it. Yeah. And then I did another audition. And then, like... Like a week later, I got it. So that's as simple as that. Yeah. And 185 million dollars later. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's amazing, man. Yeah, I mean, thank you. and to be able to, I mean, I, I've been seeing your interviews and watching you carry yourself and be poised around all of these mega stars and the world's biggest movie company like Disney and stuff. So uh, I know the 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 journey is only at the beginning, but music is your first love, right? It is. Uh, how'd you get into singing? Well, my whole family sings on my dad's side, not my mom's side. Sorry, mom. <laughs> uh, but, you know, they all sing, my aunts, my uncles, my cousins, even my dad, my brother. And, you know, it's kind of like a family heirloom to me. So, so. so was it a training thing or you just came up, like, hearing the family and you was like, yo, I, I can do what everybody else is doing? Well, it, it was kind of like that, but it took a lot of practice. Really? You know, I've been singing for, like, maybe seven years. That's more than half your life. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so. so, like, what what's uh, a 12-year-old do when, you know, because you just had your birthday, right? Yes. So what did you do to celebrate? Well, I had a lot of interviews that day, so I couldn't... <laughs> you couldn't turn up? No. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Too much cake and ice cream? Yeah, I, I couldn't do much, but I did spend it with my family, and so it was a That's good That's what birthday. it's all about right yeah. there, right? Yeah, I had a lot of sweets. Like, any interview, they're like, hey, have a cupcake. It's your birthday. And I was like, thank you. <laughs> so a lot of sweets. You you, you overboard uh, on all of the cupcakes. I understand. Yeah, yeah. Now, tell me, <laughs> let's talk Lion King for a moment, man. Let's talk Lion King. Um, The actual movie. I saw it twice. Really? Uh, yeah, yeah. How you see it twice? Because I'm a huge Lion King fan. Like, just from the, from the Broadway play to the original. So I was like, and then, you know, I was super geeked to see, like, you and... Donald Glover and Beyonce and everybody like kind of do their thing. So I saw it twice, once with my kids and then once just kind of just on a casual run. So I, I would have to say I fall asleep in every movie. Let's just say yeah. <laughs> like, like I feel you. every movie I guess I just I'm always up. So but this one kept my attention, man, like the whole attention. time. So and and it, it stuck very close to the original almost like shot for shot line for line so were you able to like put your or how because you actually did but how did you put your own spin on the character of Simba well it didn't take that much to put my own spin on the character because I feel like I can relate to Simba I look up to my dad as he does and so it didn't take that much just to change myself to be him and so I just put my own flavor on I just you definitely did too because you know 
I I came up during the the Jason Weaver version. Like that's that's a that's actually a, a close friend of mine. We did drumline together and done some different stuff. So I was like, you know, is this kid gonna be able to 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 have the same same pipes as Jason did with the Kuna Matata and all? You did it, man. You took it and you put your own spin on it. And Thank you. I think that is that to the test of like you already kind of being a recording artist and kind of knowing how to put your vibe and and that JD feel on a record. Yeah, I. Yeah, you could say that because I feel like if I were to sing a song that wasn't mine and it was like a Kuna Matata or, or any song that was in a Lion King, I feel like I can sing it like me. Yeah. yeah. And speaking of singing like you, let's talk about your uh, your EP. That My you got EP. Out. Yeah. What, what's the what's the title? The name of it is Shine. Shine. Yeah. So it's it has four songs on it. Uh, one song is with Jermaine Dupri. Yeah. The legend. Yeah, that guy right yeah, now. Yeah, it's the guy, man. So. And JD, uh, for a young talent, I mean, everybody from Bow Wow, Criss Cross, Usher, you know, many more that he started and, and kind of helped develop. Yeah. So what was it like working with him? It was really cool working with him. He's a really chill guy, you know. It, it, he's just like when I he's see him on TV. Same height yeah. as you. Are you probably yeah, taller I'm than taller him? Taller than that. <laughs> <laughs> I was just That's why he only works with kids because he has to be like <laughs> look people eye to eye in the studio. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I love yeah. you, JD. <laughs> Just playing, man. You, it's my guy. Uh, but not actually, JD's probably one of my favorite producers. Uh, obviously, he's some of the greatest R and B albums ever he produced whether it's uh usher's confessions mariah's uh from the the songs that he, he's done so many songs that always be my baby the remix to to don't forget about us to, so obviously i know mariah carries catalog pretty well but uh yeah. we, we won't dive into that but uh <laughs> but jd always knows how to spot new talent especially young talent you know from the rap game all of this so did he give you any pointers any of that type of stuff when he was working with him you know, no, no. Nah. You just said, do your thing. Well, yeah, pretty much. Get yeah, out the just, way and let God do his thing. <laughs> yeah, just, yeah, let Jesus take the wheel. There it is. <laughs> like, Jesus, make me a tape recorder and get all his songs. Uh, so <laughs> I, I got to ask you this, man. What does a 12-year-old sing about? Well, you know. Heartbreak? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, not heartbreak. Uh, just... Sing about anything that relates to you. So what are some of the songs on the EP? Well, one of them is L-O-V-E-U. That's my favorite one. It's, and who it's, is that dedicated to, J.D.? It's no one. <laughs> <laughs> to my mom. <laughs> Love you, mom. So, Good answer. Yeah. <laughs> Kids wise. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that song is just about, it's basically what it spells, L-O-V-E-U. Just, you know, yeah. come with somebody. Yeah. Yeah, having special place there it is not where my heart is special place. <laughs> and you got so much charisma and swag i mean from from the haircut to how you carry yourself man where you. where does where does that vibe come from well it comes i keep saying well before everything i'm gonna stop saying that <laughs> it comes from you know my family how they raised me um yeah just just how i am it's, it's that's always just been me you know it comes from and you're the oldest? Love. You're the older brother? No, or, or you... that's that's the older brother over there. Oh, really? And you're taller than him. I am. I, <laughs> I've always been taller than him, but that, you know, <laughs> his voice dropped, and so it was all over. All like, he started working out. So are you the out. youngest? I am the youngest. Oh, wow. Yeah. And the entire family? like are... it's, it's just me and him. It's just you. Oh, okay. Yeah. But I am the youngest. Wow. That's kind of that's kind of cool. I wish I was. Uh, I'm see. I'm probably in, I'm the same way as your brother. All my younger brothers are taller than me, <laughs> and I know what that feels like. I'm mad at you right now. <laughs> Who's hey. better in basketball? He, Is that the truth? Yeah. Yes, yeah, it's, it's the truth. Yeah, I, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't. Your older brother says it. Just, <laughs> it. It only happened for so long, man. It, you know, it it balances out once you get older. Huh? Yeah. All my. Taller, younger brothers are very scared of me. <laughs> <laughs> in any sport, I, I still dominate. <laughs> so, man, so uh, your EP, movies, what's next? Well, I guess what's, I just said well, you know. <laughs> but that was a real well. You well, were really like, you had to ponder about that. Uh-huh, so. Oh, as well, you're already on TV, so you got the TV show thing. Yeah, I got probably. the TV show. We're going to be able to I'm see you to... live anywhere, touring. Yes, I was just about to say that. I'm trying to set up a tour so yeah. I can go around the world. Um, I might go to Japan pretty soon. Nice. Because I was just talking to a guy that, you know, is from Japan. A he Japanese to... person? 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Were well, you Wanna speaking be... Japanese to him? Nah, I'm gonna learn Japanese. I'm gonna learn Japanese. Uh, if you gotta go over there, you gotta speak. I gotta it. learn Japanese. They got some fly clothes yeah. and, and like architecture and stuff over there too. You're gonna turn up on the art stuff when you get over there. Yeah. Tokyo is crazy. One yeah, of my favorite places on the planet. Japanese is gonna be fun. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna learn I'm gonna learn that language. You have next time I'm here, easy, I'm gonna be speaking though. Japanese. It's not easy. It's, it's just say not. konnichiwa to everybody. Yeah, konnichiwa. <laughs> so touring any more movies? Are we going to check you out in anything else soon? Haven't been in any movies lately. Uh, well, I'm in another movie called Little. I don't know if you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm absolutely. in that movie. Yeah. But nothing that's coming out soon. Maybe soon if, you know, if I start recording anything, if I get a role. But nothing well, so far. I want to be and... Miles Morales, though. Uh -huh. I do want to be that. Like, if they're going to make a movie about him. All right. Come on, Disney. Marvel. Yeah. Disney owns Marvel. Come on. See, oh, he's right shooting here. the shot. You see, you I'm hear right it. Here. He's right there. And then I think you 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 off to a good start. I mean, thank you. <laughs> starring in The Lion King, uh, obviously, is breaking records. And, uh, you know, much continued success to you, man. Thank you, sir. It's nice to meet All you. All right. Man. Pleasure meeting you, too. There yeah. it is.